Hey everyone, this is Battery Blade and welcome to another video. In this video, I'm gonna be testing out all three electric cars to see which one has the best range and efficiency in winter. We have our Tesla Model 3 2023 and it has a heat pump in it, which means it should be efficient. We have our 2019 Chevy Bolt. This one does not have a heat pump. And we have our 2022 Kia EV6 wind long range. So, and that one does have a heat pump. So let's see which car is the most efficient in this Michigan winter. The way we are doing this test is we are going to take all three cars along the same route with the same climate settings and as close of the same conditions as we can get. We can figure out which car does it with the least amount of energy and which car is good if you wanna buy a car in a cold state. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. I would really appreciate it. This is what we are starting our car off with, 179 miles, 72%. And this is our trip odometer. Um, and then this is winter mode. And we did just reset it. Here is our climate settings. We are, have the fan speed at three and 68 degrees Fahrenheit and heated seats on, and we're doing this with every single car, so that way it will be as fair as possible. And we are also turning on full eye pedal mode for this car, which is the same thing as um, one pedal driving in the Tesla or Volt. So let's get on our winter route. I am now in the 2019 Chevy. It has no heat pump or anything like that. It uses inductive heating. We're setting it at 68 like the other car, we're gonna put both our heated seats on full. And we are also um, have all the settings the same. We're gonna turn on our fan there. So that way it's all the same. You can see our trip is reset. Let's check out our efficiency. Also, we have this information right here screen, which gives us a graph. Pretty cool. Right now, this is what we're at because this is since full charge. So we'll kind of ignore this data. Um, Let's get going. Time to test out the Tesla. Here are the stats. Here is our current stuff. We are at 81 miles, or 81% safe charge, 260 miles. And this is our current trip, is what I will show during the drive. Now let's get the test on. And of course, our settings are the same, 68 degrees. With a lot of this stop and go, we've noticed that this I pedal mode is the one pedal mode is not as strong in the other cars. Here is our efficiency so far. And see how we're doing in another car. 2019 Chevy Bolt update. We are four miles in and we're at three miles per kilowatt hour. Let's check some energy graphs, which the Kia EV6 does not really have. See there. Um, this isn't going to change much because that's since full charge. But see, efficiency wise, the EV6 is beating us right now, but three miles per kilowatt hour isn't really bad. Here's a Tesla update. We are currently four miles in, duration six minutes, and we're at 307 watt hours per mile, which means uh, 307 is 3.2 kilowatt hours per mile, is our current efficiency. We're in our EV6. Let's watch as our efficiency goes up down this giant uh, long sloping road. We were just at 3.4 and now it went up to 3.6. Update in the Chevy Bolt at the hill that we go down and our efficiency has gone up to 3.3 miles per kilowatt hour. We are 12.8 miles into the drive and you can see we're at 71 miles it predicts us to have we still kept our uh, heated seats at the uh, same way and let's show you how the tesla's doing so at the bottom of the hill look at the tesla we are at 3.9 miles per kilowatt hour or 254 watt hours per mile 13 miles in at the bottom of the hill so that's why our efficiency is a little better taking this uh, back road area. So we'll see if uh, the Tesla can beat the EV6, but right now they're pretty neck and neck. Now, uh, 
I'm sure you just saw the footage of the bolt uh, not doing so hot right now. So that's kind of funny. We are now merging onto the highway with our Kia EV6. Check our stats. We're up to 3.9 on our efficiency. 3.9 miles per kilowatt hour efficiency. A little less snow over here. It's not a uh, freezing cold day, but it's definitely a winter day. Oh no, we are running into uh, some traffic with the Kia EV6. Check out that Model Y. And we're in the Chevy Bolt getting onto the freeway. 13 miles in. Let's see as our efficiency goes down from 3.3 during our freeway section. The Kia EV6 probably has the most advantages in this test because we got into uh, quite a lot of traffic on the freeway for the Kia. And the temperature outside was slightly warmer during the Kia's test. And here is the footage of the Tesla getting on the highway. And I'll show you the efficiency in a second once we get up to speed. Let's see if the Tesla can hold the efficiency of 3.8 on the highway. I have a feeling it might drop. Update in the Chevrolet Bolt. The highway and surprisingly getting off or uh, going on the highway did not hurt our efficiency as much as I thought. We are still at 3.1 miles per kilowatt hour and we got on the highway with 3.3 miles per kilowatt hour. So the Bolt is doing pretty well for uh, highway driving. We are in the Kia EV now and we are getting 3.7 miles per kilowatt hour at the 25 mile mark with 33 minutes in. And check out our battery state of charge. We're almost to the destination. And we are in the home stretch with the Bolt EV. Just a few uh, more miles to go. We're at 3.1 miles per kilowatt hour of miles per kilowatt hour efficiency. And we got 55 miles left on our battery. Update in the Tesla. Got off the highway and our efficiency is at 259 watts hours per mile, which is 3.84 miles per kilowatt hour. And we're 25 miles into the trip, 32 minutes. Check out our uh, battery percentages at 69 and estimates 184 miles. So see, I think the Tesla is doing uh, really uh, well with the Kia and that they're basically tied right now. So we'll see when we get home, uh, which one used less. We have finished the Kia EV6 2022 test and the Kia EV6 had an efficiency of drumroll 3.6 miles per kilowatt hour which is a very efficiency in the winter and that must be because of the heat pump. Now let me tell you the results of the other cars. The Bolt EV made it home and it only used 10.4 kilowatt hours to go like 32 miles. So we took the same exact standard test and the Bolt came in less efficient than the Kia EV6. I expect that's because the Kia EV6 has a heat pump unlike the Chevy Bolt 2019, but 3.1 miles per kilowatt hour is still good results. Let's move on to the results of the Tesla. I wonder if the Tesla won or not and which car you should get for the winter time. Make sure you like and subscribe if you haven't already. We are home and I'll show you the Tesla's efficiency real quick before I film the uh, conclusion. Show you the results of all the cars. The Tesla got 257 watt hours per mile, which is 3.89 miles per kilowatt hour. Now let's go over the conclusion of the challenge on which car is the most efficient in the winter and if the cars display an accurate range number. I have a feeling that maybe the Tesla's range number is inaccurate because they're always accused of not having an accurate range number, but let's see once and for all if their range number is accurate after we drove 32 miles. And I am home and I've reviewed the footage so I can give you the results you deserve. So the results are um, obviously the Tesla comes in first place. It had a 3.9 mile per kilowatt hour uh, efficiency. Kia came in second with 3.6.
the bolt came in last place with like 3.3 I think it was but the number you really want to know is um how much of a displayed difference is there between the cars now that by that I mean uh that the car displays miles does your uh, display go down faster than the actual miles you drive and the answer is the Tesla's range started off with 216 miles displayed and then we theoretically traveled 41 miles all the way down to 175 miles displayed but obviously that's not true we only traveled 32 miles which means the Tesla display sort of uh, lied to us that it's going down quicker than the actual amount of miles we traveled. Now I'm going to tell you what the Kia's display showed and if the Kia was accurate or if it lied to over exaggerate. The Kia EV6 started the challenge off with 179 miles displayed and ended the challenge with 144 miles which means we theoretically traveled 35 miles during this challenge but in the real world we actually traveled 32 miles. So the Kia EV6 was just barely off, so I'll give it a pass that it wasn't intentionally trying to lie to us. Now let's move on to the Bolt. The displayed range of the Chevy Bolt was 81 miles at the start of the challenge, and we ended the challenge with a displayed range of 54 miles, which meant the Chevy Bolt estimated that we traveled 27 miles. But in reality, we went further than 27 miles. We went 32 miles, which means the Chevy Bolt underestimated how much uh, range it can give you which is much better and more conservative than the other two cars that were overstating its range. Also something to note it ended the challenge with 54 miles not 60 like it will show in my video that's because uh, the video I took it it uh, was with climate controls off which increased the range number um, just wanted to address that. The Tesla Model 3 is the most efficient car in the winter. The Chevy Bolt is the most transparent when it comes to the range estimates. If you're still confused, just leave me a question down below in the comments or if you doubt my test and I will answer your questions. So thank you very much for watching this video. Please like and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.